This play came out of Craig's response to the AIDS crisis. And the idea, the concept I think that he was working with was this idea that when you're with somebody who's sick, you're with a young, strong man one day, and the next day with an old man ravaged by, by this terrible disease. The play sort of takes that as a kind of central metaphoric conceit and completely transmutes it into this sort of magical romantic comedy where the female protagonist switches souls with an old man and, and he inhabits her body and she his. Craig was thinking a lot about fairy tales, kind of the more adult fairy tales, fairy tales before they get Disneyfied. The fairy tales that really are a visceral response and that are actually really scary. There's a little bit of that peppered through this piece. If you transplanted this to some mythical fairy tale land and, you know, that the princess gets bedazzled by the evil old sorcerer and, and is, they switch bodies and the young prince has to, you know, ride on the gallant steed and figure the whole thing out and find her. I wouldn't be surprised to stumble across some Brothers Grimm tale that had those elements. It's a romance, but it's poignant, and I think that's one of the things he does best, is he takes really big themes and makes them incredibly accessible in a very sweet and human way.